Hey everybody, Neil Malik with Knack Training here bringing you another Everyday Office video. Today's video is an automatic Monday about a keyboard shortcut you should create for yourself in PowerPoint. So on my screen is a situation people find themselves in on a fairly regular basis. You have a bunch of shapes and you want to go ahead and uh, sort of line these up, spread them apart, you know, do those sorts of things with them. Now, if you click on your different shapes, at the top of the screen on the Format tab, you'll see that you can go in here and bring some of the shapes to the front, send them to the back, or using the Align drop-down menu, align them to the center or the middle or the top or the bottom or the left or the right, and distribute them across the slide. Instead of going and looking for this though, if I use this on a regular enough basis, I'm going to right click on this entry right here and choose the option for add it to the quick access toolbar. What you'll see is that that goes on to the end of the quick access toolbar up here in the top left hand corner. But not only does this make it easy to push this button, but in fact, if you press the Alt key on the keyboard, you'll notice that all of the entries on your quick access toolbar are assigned number values based on their position on the quick access toolbar. So all I have to do now is press the six, for example, and I'll be able to use those alignment tools. Let me go ahead and see if that works. So the first thing I'll do is a quick control A to select all the shapes at the same time. And then here, Alt six. I'll want to align the middle points. Let's go ahead and press M there. You can see there that it's lined them all up and all the center points of the different shapes are aligned with one another. Now, if I want to distribute these across, let's go to Alt-6 again, and let's use Align to Slide, the letter A right there, and then Alt-6, and press the Distribute Horizontally option, which is H. And you see there, because I'm aligning this across the slide, it's perfectly distributed these across the entirety of the screen. And I've done all this with nothing more than the keyboard, a couple of quick presses, and I have a perfect distribution of the slide. <laughs> 